One of the types of charts that you can insert inside of Google Data Studio is an area chart. So to insert out an area chart, I'm going to go around and click add a chart right here, just like this. And I'm going to go around and scroll down and here you can see area is an option. If I were to go around over here and click on an area chart right here, click, what happens is that the chart gets inserted right here. So for the data of this chart, I'm just going to go around and select out a sample data. So I'm going to go around onto the data source right here, close out the uh, source right here. And then what I'm going to do is click on select data source right here and then select out a sample data right here. So let's just go around onto sample YouTube data right here and insert that out just like this. So once I do that, what happens is that you can see the area chart right here, as you can see. So right now, the breakdown dimension right now is the uh, United States code right here. But let's say I want something else like country code right here. And then you will have uh, similar uh, similar codes right here, as you can see. So metric right now is what's time. But if I were to go around and go to views, then you will see a different metric as you can see right here per country basis right here. So if I were to hover around, you will be able to see the view right here, just like this. You can also go around and change this out and you can see like a graph like area chart, just like this. Similarly, you can go around and add in different types of area charts. So there's stacked version of area charts as you can see right here. So you can bring that in over here as well, which is much more curvy as you can see. And you can go around over here and bring in, let's say, for example, another type of area chart over here as well, uh, just like this, as you can see. So that is how you can add an area chart. And then you can also go around and work around with style to show points right here. So stacks right here, as you can see, then you can go around. So cumulative data is right here and so forth and change around the type of grid, as you can see right here and so forth as well. And that is how you can work around with area chart inside of Google Data Studio. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.